sometimes that's not very good because, um, like, um, if you look at Mistralis and you, uh, and if I tried to do that with, um, the boats tab, um, it would zoom in on every single cruiser dock in the city and there's like 17 of them. So it would, it would cycle through them one at a time. Uh, it's not always that useful. I accidentally tapped out, tabbed out. I'm hoping that didn't destroy my whole thing recording. I'm sure to be fine. <laughs> <laughs> All right, I, I did what AD Low Wealth Sims intended. Good job, way to go, people. A thousand bucks for free. I got an achievement. <laughs> Which one? Uh, something about worshiping. Oh, yeah, that one, those ones. Um, oh, actually, yeah, make fun of the little peons of Sim City. I see how you are. There's actually three of them for the uh, House of Worship, because one of, the, one of them's for each um, wealth class. The high wealth one's actually pretty hard, because um, whenever you zone high wealth, there aren't as many Sims living there. So it's, um... Basically, um, it's, uh... Four Sims will live in a rich mansion, but in that same space, you could have um, three trailers instead, each holding, I don't know, how many is this? Twelve. So it's um, that's the difference between high wealth and low wealth. High wealth has a lot fewer people living in it. Yeah. So is the only so you just do residential zones now? You don't like do the density of them or um, density is controlled by uh, density is you suggest a density by um, upgrading the road in front of it, and if you treat the building right over time, eventually you'll get up to high density. Uh, so no fires, um, no crimes, no people dying, blah blah blah. Basically, life has to be pretty good. For the upgrades to come in um, now as for the land wealth of the area you control that indirectly through um, building things like parks and city services so like um, say you have a community college next to a baseball field um, that'll spawn a lot of medium wealth land value around it and you'll get medium wealth sims living there well then um, the other thing to know is that um, when you when you have multiple wealth levels, they each need their own shops to shop at. Um, rich Sims will not eat your ramen. Um, poor Sims can't afford a rich Sims caviar either. So each wealth level needs to have its own commercial with along with it. As for industry, does not care about land value at all. They care about education. Because if your sims are attending community college or university, um, your um, industry will tech up. And that means they produce more freight and they pollute less. I was going to ask about that too. <laughs> so you've got to... So to get tech... To get your tech levels up, you have to get higher education. So high school, high school doesn't help. You need community college at least. Most cities are educated through community colleges. There, you can get a university, but it's pretty hard to operate it, and it's not really conducive to the goal of earning 10 million simoleons by the end of year four, because it's it's so expensive. So each day is a year. Each day is a month. Oh, okay. Because that's really starting to sweat about that. So every every sun cycle, that's. Ah, uh, okay. That makes much much better sense now so you have uh, four times you have 48 days I think is my math right maybe if we had a city hall they could lower our taxes well, maybe if you shut the fuck up I wouldn't have to worry about it I don't like a game that argues back with me you can you can shut them up in the game settings it's like, uh, we have so many smarty pants that a university would be great. I don't believe them. So year one, you're saying you just take care of the basics, right? 
No, month one, you take care of the basics. Month two, you take care of garbage, fire, health, police. Month three, education. You can skip uh, medical for quite a while, actually. Yeah, well, I still I have no money, so it's not gonna matter. Uh, you, did you spend that whole 500k I was sent you? I never got any money. You didn't? Hmm. <laughs> That's not what I see on my end. I have 1,647 simoleons right now. And the city budget dude tells me we are profitable. You'd have to do something pretty silly to be losing hourly in this case, this early. Well, have you ever watched me play before? Yes. <laughs> do you have any idea who he is? <laughs> I have this special ability that I break games. <laughs> it's called not bringing the soul to the heist. Streetcars are for little girly cities. Heavy rail is what we need. I thought it told me at the start this did have rail connection. Oh, is that what that is? That is what that is. Usually, there's a, usually the railroads are right on the edge of the map. There's only one city that has rail and the rails in the, <laughs> rails in the middle of the map. It's going through your city, but yes. that's only one city. There's, usually it should be, you should be, you should see it on the edge somewhere. So what's this large black hole that's under this underpass or this interstate leading out of my city? scares me. Mm. I'm sure it's a graphical <laughs> issue, but... Yeah, is it, is it next to one of your roads? Uh, it's outside of the city. Outside the city? Yes. yes, yes. Uh, it could be a bunch of my buildings in Enforcer Ridge. That's the only thing that I see that's really black on my screen. No. Who knows? Maybe I'm just going crazy. Need more workers. Okay. Yeah, there's almost there's almost never enough residential. Yes, I, I'm learning keep that. Keep at high density. Watching all my people. They have a purple car. That is an ugly, ugly car. It's Prius. Wait until you see the criminal cars. They're lime green. There's a bunch of yellow cabs, and my city's got a bunch of high wealth tourists in it. So well, I don't even have a police department, so it doesn't matter. <laughs> doesn't matter yet. <laughs> Soon it will. It says I'm making all this money, but I don't believe it. <laughs> <laughs> have you changed your taxes at all? No. No. The optimal tax rate is 12, 11, 10 for all RCI. I can't change my tax rates. I don't have a town hall. You, there's a regional department of finance. Oh. Should be, that should let you change the taxes. Bad move, creep. If you're not getting unlocks, then there's probably a connection issue between um, your computer and um, the game servers so you should be getting on you should be getting unlocks and you should be getting gifts and um, if you're not getting anything then um, your computer is probably not um, connected to the uh, game server which then game server tells your computer that hey there's all these unlocks um, well, I got a whole bunch of things that popped up at the start but yeah those are probably all your DLC that the game just gives you like a Roman Luck Casino. And like, such. where would I go to see what I've got? Uh, they're usually scattered in whatever tab the uh, DLC is in. Like, if you get the, uh, if you get the um, Heroes and Villains DLC, um, all that's under the police. 
And the progressive insurance office is under the fire, I think. And if you get the Red Cross, um, that's under health. The only thing I have under police right now is police station and police precinct. Is the precinct unlocked? Yes. Okay. We should be getting unlocks. It costs ninety-five thousand dollars, but it's the, you could build it if you really wanted to. Um, I'm I seriously think your computer's not currently connected to the game servers, SKS, because I'm taking a look at your city and um, all I see are the same five streets and the one avenue from um, the start. Damn you, EA! Why do you do this to me? So, um, I think you're not, I don't think your computer is connected to the game servers, so you need to reboot. You need to just, you just need to restart the game. Oh the... my god, EA. You have made a powerful enemy today.